Hello everyone, this is Logan, and in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to get YouTube on iOS 6, a few different methods on how to do so. So, if you aren't aware, when Apple officially launched iOS 6, they got rid of the YouTube app, which has pretty much been with us ever since Apple OS 1.0 on the original iPhone and iPod Touch. So, I'm going to be showing you how to get it. For, if you see, if we go into settings, I am, by the way, on 6.0. So, I'm going to show you how to get it. First method is Safari. And I would also like to point out, these three methods are you don't have to jailbreak and it is free the next two methods you do need to jailbreak but they're still free so either way you're not paying a penny unless you don't have an Apple device in that case I don't know just go on YouTube on your computer I don't know you probably are watching YouTube anyway somehow otherwise you wouldn't be watching this video anyway Safari YouTube It's YouTube on Safari, the mobile version of YouTube. And you can also go to Settings in Safari, push Add to Home Screen, and if you would like, you can add YouTube to your home screen as I have done. So, that's a pretty good way of doing it, but if you do want a regular app, something you would get from the App Store. Here's the mobile version of YouTube, which, again, you can get from the App Store for free. And if you may remember, in my iOS 6 review and comparison, I briefly went over this, and I said that this was great. It isn't. I honestly don't really care for it. It's just not for me. It might be for you, but, well, let's go over a few of the features. Uh, here's how channels look on the standard YouTube app. And another interesting feature, if we would go back to home, is that if you push search, it has sort of a imitation Siri sort of thing for all the people who have older eye devices. For instance, if you tap this, puppies. And as you can see, it has in fact acknowledged that I said puppies. And you can look at all the puppy-related videos, which is like 60% of YouTube. So that's the mobile version of YouTube that you can get off the App Store. Now, you may be wondering, what's this? This is another YouTube app that isn't made by Google. It's an unofficial YouTube app. It is called U Downloader, and it is, if you're not going to jailbreak, this is probably the best way to go. Because, I mean, you know, it's it tries very hard to emulate the YouTube app. The only thing kind of keeping it from that, well, one of the main things is this advertisement. But if you actually would pay money for it, it's actually quite a good emulator of the original YouTube app. Well, not exactly. I, I don't know. It's just not quite as good, you know. Plus, not to mention, again, if you don't want that ad, you have to pay money. But, you know, you can go to my videos and for whatever reason has a screenshot from my speakeasy review that I did many months ago. That is before I learned how to use editing. And, you know, it's pretty good. 
if you're not going to jailbreak, again, it's the next best thing. And speaking of jailbreaking, here are the two apps that come from Cydia. First up is ProTube, and you can get this from Cydia, and I don't even think you have to add any sources. So, here is the app. Now you may be saying, well, this is exactly like the Safari version. It almost is. Apart from one thing, if you would swipe up here, you could push download, and if I actually had something to download, you could do a 360p video, 240p video, and you could add those to camera roll, or you could download another program called Bridge, and you could actually take it to your iPod. So, basically, let's say you want to uh, download a song. Let's say, uh, for the sake of demonstrational purposes, Blink-182, all the small things. Why not? So go to ProTube, swipe up, do the audio thing, and you can have all the small things on your iPod, and you don't need to pay the 99 cents or $1.99 that it costs on iTunes. So, that's quite a good feature, and I would have to say this is probably the third best YouTube app, apart from Udownloader and the official YouTube app, which, yeah, I bet you've probably noticed that. Probably because there's only two things to notice uh, on screen right now. But, yep, this is the original YouTube app. Uh, but, as I said before, I'm on iOS 6. How is this possible? I'll show you how it's possible. Go to Cydia. And, once you're there, go to Manage Sources. And, you will... And you will add a source called repo.insanelyi.com. Once you've done that, go to search. And type in YouTube. for iOS 6, and I'm not going to bother downloading that. Now, you may be saying, it's probably that program where it has the YouTube icon, but it just takes you to the Safari version of YouTube. Well, if you're thinking that, you are wrong. This is quite literally the same data for the iOS 5.1.1 and backward YouTube. Well backward to like 4.3 where they actually did something with it and you know change all the stars to percents but yep as you can see this is the official YouTube app and you can you know go on all your subscriptions and you can search your videos your playlists your most viewed you can search videos if there's actually a video called that oh cool but, yeah, this is, in fact, the same YouTube app from 5.1.1. So, if you're jailbroken, and you want the original YouTube app, and you, well, you like the simplicity of the YouTube app, or maybe you're just one of those people who used to hate it, but when they finally got rid of it, you're like, no, oh my god, I love this YouTube app, why did they get rid of it? Then... Download YouTube for iOS 6 on Cydia. If you don't have Cydia and you don't want to jailbreak or you're too afraid that something bad will happen to your iPod if you jailbreak or you don't know how to jailbreak or you're too lazy to jailbreak, you downloader, or no, n not you downloader, you player, I mean, you player is probably the best way to go. So, until next time, bye.